Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to draw Sea Fairy Cookie from Cookie Run Kingdom. So, so, don't mind if there's a little cat, that's just my pet, or at least one of them. So, first things first, you're going to want, so you can kind of see her on my Nintendo Switch, and we're going to be drawing that. So. First, you're going to want to draw like a, a sort of half circle in the middle. And then you're going to want to draw kind of like that. And then you're going to want to like um, finish the head, so go down a bit. And at this little hand thing. I'm sorry if I don't get it right. I'm trying. So then, like that. No, it doesn't look best or, or as good as you thought it was. That's completely fine. If you mess up, just like I did, you can just erase it. See? So, as you can see, there we go, so we're going to carry on, like the head darling rest thing, sorry, I don't know why I said that, anyways, we're going to go down kind of like that, if it looks too big, just rub it out, that's fine, just keep going, now, if it looks too big and you kind of regret it, it's fine, just keep going, so then we're going to go kind of down. Now if it's too short or something, that's fine. Just keep going. Now, there you go. That kind of big, big line. And then we'll add the details later, okay? Then we're going to add these lines. Or the other hand. Then we're going to add this little thing right here. Now, you can go through it, because that's what the picture looks like. Yes, I'm coughing off of the cutscene picture, but it's fine. So anyways, like that. So, down like this. Nice. So, you've done that. Now, we're going to carry on here. So, you've done that. Now, you're going to want to erase this part. Like, add sort of a stew, a sort of thing that makes it go behind it, like that, you know? And then you're gonna go like this and connect it like this, like that. And then we will add the little sword thing in the corner. And so now it's got like a sort of diamond rock thing on it. And then it's got like a C covering it. Like that. So, and then you're going to add her dress, or, well, you know. So, we're going to add this little thing here. And go down. 
to the sea rock thing, and then we're gonna stop there. Now, over here, you might wanna go over a bit more. Add a V here. And then this sort of circle, like clamping onto the V, kind of an upside down U. And then, we're going to slowly add a little line going up and we're going to sort of go down like that and then add some little details over here. I'd say it's pretty accurate so far. Yours doesn't look perfect, it's fine. So we're gonna add this tiny little circle down here. And this one here. We're gonna go here. Like that. Now remember you can pause the video if you need any more time. So then you're nextly gonna add this little sort of shortcut line here, right there. You can add the circle here, the triangle here, and then the tiny circle right there. And we're gonna add two these thin lines like this, and I'll circle next to the line. Now we're going to draw her crown, so we're going to add this little diamond circle, and then another diamond circle, another diamond circle, and a smaller diamond circle. So now we're going to go like this, and then up like this, and then over here, and then we're going to draw a big line up here, and connect it to the crown. Now we're going to cut her in. Now I'm not going to fast forward, but like other YouTubers, I'm just going to get my cat off the scene real quick. And then we're going to, um, I'm going to try and keep the pencil sharpening, so hold on. Okay, so anyways, now we're going to colour it in. So you're going to take your blue pencil, if you have one. And oh, and one, and then you have it. Just set it down. And now with the eyebrow, you're gonna just need to quickly add a little line here as well. And then set a circle here, a little circle here, line here. And then you're gonna add some circles inside these diamonds. And now you're ready to colour in. So get your pencil and start colouring in the top. Now don't colour in any of the holes or, or anything. Just keep going like this. Like that, yeah. And now I don't exactly have a light blue, so I'll add like this i don't exactly know what color it is but it seems bluish maybe i'll try this one as well so anyways i'm going to add it like right here for some shading and now you can either add like some yellow onto the crown Kind of like that. Or you can just keep it white. It's your choice. But I'm going to add the yellow. Now, we are going to draw the background for the people who really want it. Don't worry. 
And if your piece of paper is too big, just add some random lines on it to make it look better. And now keep going like that, and then a bigger one. Nice. So now we're also going to do the sword. So like top, put a little line here. And then we're also going to add some right here. Now you're going to have to get a blue colour and add it right there and there. And then you're going to add it here. And here. And then you're going to get a different shade of blue and quickly add it right in here. Now if you need a second to get some more blue, just pause the video, okay? So then we're gonna do the little eyes. So you keep that blue right here, put it there, and then put it back. Now quickly cover it up with the other blue on the outside. And you can use this other blue for the dots. So add that on. And you can use it for the inside of the line as well. By the way guys, on the day I'm posting this, it's one of my friend's birthdays tomorrow. So, happy birthday, if, if you're watching. So, then you're going to quickly get the other blue. And you're going to add it right here. You're going to add a shade of your bottom blue right there, though. And then get the other blue and add it on the top. Now, you're going to use the other blue and put it right here. And also, if you haven't already drawn the waveform, kind of like me, I'm going to quickly draw that up to the V. So you're going to colour that in with the other blue. Mm -hmm. And then go like that. And colour in the top part with it. Now, get your orange or yellow and go like this with it. Now, get a yellow or orange or whatever you've been using and then add it over the top of the other colour you've been using. And keep doing that. Now this bottom part, we're going to use quite a lot of brown. I'm going to put that there. And then over the top, you're going to add some orange. Keep doing that till you think it's good. And now get your other blue. And add it right in here. Then right over here as well. And we're very close to the end, but don't worry. Just a bit longer. So now you're going to add your other blue. And put it right here. And then quickly add it here. Now, for this part, you're going to want to get your orange colour in this little arm here. And now, add some brown right here. And we're going to 
gonna fill in this other spot with a blue. And then I'm gonna add some yellow over the top of this part. The arm. Okay, here we are. Oh. And then we're gonna oh and then we're gonna quickly go here and add this right here. Colour this in and also colour in this spot. And then we're going to add some of the other blue. over the top of this and now we've done that we've got a we've got a few other things to do on the crown see so we're gonna get our darker blue and add this on the side it's not really a darker blue it's more of like a sort of yellow so we've done that and now you're gonna add color in the rest over with yellow so you've done that Right, so we have completed Sea Fairy Cookie. So now we're going to do the background. So now this time get your dark blue or whatever you better call it. I'm going to use this and colour over the sea with it. Now. It doesn't matter if it's going to look amazing or anything. But, um, we're going to go over here and colour the bottom in for later. Now, if you guys were asking, I'm going to be putting this on my wall. So, yeah. Um, in the comments, tell me what tutorial you want next. Uh, like, um, like for, um, some more cookie tutorials as well. So, um, you've done that, yeah. So now you're going to go back, get your pencil and add a big line right here and a circle like a big long line and then another long circle line like that and now you're gonna add this like a sort of cloud shape you know and you're gonna add it up to sea fairy Mm -hmm. like that now you're going to add a line off the top going off the edge and then you're also 